We are following breaking news this evening. More than 30 people are in jail tonight in CUNY County for conspiracy to riot in downtown Coeur d'Alene and in the Pride in the Park event. Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Emily Bloom. Police have reason to believe that group is connected to a white supremacist organization. Eleni Dow is live in Coeur d'Alene tonight with what we know so far. Eleni? Emily, Coeur d'Alene Police and the Kootenai County Sheriff's Office arrested 31 people at this corner here in Coeur d'Alene. Uh, and those people, they say, were part of a white nationalist group called Patriot Front. Police say they found riot gear in the U-Haul, including shields, shin guards, and a smoker grenade. Coeur d'Alene Police say a concerned citizen called 911, saying they saw 20 people jump into a U-Haul wearing masks and had shields. Police stopped them about a block from the Pride in the Park Festival in Coeur d'Alene City Park. Police say those arrested are from multiple states, including Washington, Idaho, Texas, South Dakota, and more. The Coeur d'Alene police chief could not say whether or not they had other weapons besides a smoker grenade. Police also found papers that look similar to an operations plan. Those 31 people each face a conspiracy to riot charge, which is only a misdemeanor in Idaho. And it wasn't just City Park that they were planning to riot in. There was some other information they were planning on going down Sherman, for instance. Um, so preventing a riot by arresting 31 people with the misdemeanor, I will gladly do that every day of the week. In it. In addition to the 31 arrested, police arrested two more people at Pride in the Park event, one person for disorderly conduct and another for trespassing. Those people were not from Idaho either. All those, are, all those arrested here today are being processed in jail tonight, and they will be facing a judge on Monday, which the police department says they will have more information then. Of course, we will continue to keep you up to date on this situation on KXLY.com and on 4 News Now. Live in Coeur d'Alene tonight, I'm Eleni Dow, 4 News Now.